Hey guys, it's me, Dr. Trey Gaming, and I'm back for another video. Sorry I haven't uploaded a video in a while, but today I'm going to be trying to make a recreation of the jungle temple in Minecraft. So, um, I'm going to try and make a series where I recreate every single structure in Minecraft, and let's see how that works. Also, I changed my skin once again. I am not the avatar, <laughs> but also still Pancake Gang, so join Pancake Gang right now. And yeah, let's get into it, and I hope you guys will enjoy the series. And yeah, if you do want to see more from the series, leave a like, and comment down below. Yeah, thank you guys so much for... So, I just finished building. It's not the best looking structure there is, but this is just a base so that I can make it more functional. So, and I'm going to be building this room by room. This will not be the, it won't be interconnected. It will be more of a, like, different part thing. So, let's do that. And, okay. So, um... I wanted to make it so that it requires a certain type of item, like a key, to get inside. Because it makes sense that they would have some sort of technology like that. And I need to also do something else, like make blue uh, fire. I would have expected that they would have went to the nether by then. So, maybe there's going to be a portal inside. Or like, and this could be customized per, like... It will be randomized, maybe, like, per tribe, so each tribe has their own different, um, traps or different keys that you need to find in your world to even enter the structure. So, I think that would be cool, so, like, they would have their own glazed terracotta, like, green, red, black, blue, yellow, white, I don't know, so, it'd be pretty cool, so, and then you would have to remember which one does what, and it'd be more dangerous because you don't know what's going to be in there and the trap could either be hard like difficult to get through or very simple um 
because the original one uh, it's pretty you know like like the traps are not that good so I'm gonna make my own traps that are gonna be pretty epic so I'm gonna get into decorating the exterior a little bit but my building isn't the best so please have mercy on me <laughs> I'm not the best builder. I wish I could get one of my friends online who's actually a better builder than me, but mm, it's fine. So we got this structure. It'd be better. I expect Minecraft to make this way better. It's just, you know, I'm, I'm doing it more for the interior. So, like, imagine this is how it would look. It'd be kind of raised like that. Well, I expect it to be very deteriorated, but like the floor, maybe it's made out of some sort of like powerful material, not really a smoothing table, but you know, like extremely durable, new block introduced, you know. So.
So what you do guys is you place three gold blocks on over the fire. So once you've done that, they all disappear, they become particles, and then this door opens. So once it opens, you have access to the vault. Of course, I don't really know what to place in here, so I mean you got a couple diamonds, ancient debris, diamonds, ancient debris, just two pieces of ancient debris, some terracotta, and um chain. So that would be really cool if you know you can do you can have better loot in here because it requires three gold blocks which is like what 27 bits of gold i'm pretty sure yeah i think 27 so yeah i mean it makes sense i mean you sacrificed a lot so you should get a lot but you can i want to make it so that when you extinguish all three fires you can fight a boss so uh, th this is going to be a pretty long series, guys. This is the end of episode 1. So this was just the entrance to the jungle temple. Tomorrow, if I have time, or maybe like later next week or something like that, I'll make episode 2. So, in episode 2, we're going to have the boss room, or the boss spawning area, as in you, you'd knock out all the fires, and once you've knocked out every single fire, it spawns the boss, like, right here, like, it, like, destroys the ground, it starts shaking and stuff, so that would be really cool, like, a cool earthquake scene, and I, I want to make it so that for every single different type of, um, uh, different type of temple for every single different tribe, you can actually gain elemental powers. That'd be so cool. Like for this one's gonna be the light one, so like you can blast a light beam. Of course, that's only like one of the weakest ones, but like another one would be like an increased strength, and then like increased particles, and then um, the light would be like I don't know what kind of like other element would fall into that i mean pretty much like fire i guess so you could fire bend and then there would be like the red one the black one would be like the void so water would be you know the blue one would be water uh so and then the green one would be earth you know all that kind of stuff so i'm gonna make that i uh, hope you guys did enjoy 
you did enjoy, please hit the like button and um, subscribe if you're new so that you don't miss out on more content that I got for you guys. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.